I usually say that anyone who never knew Bob, well, you know, this generation is different. But then I usually say anyone who never knew Bob, they, they missed out on so much in life. To have known that man was something else. He was truly sent by the Almighty to do the work he did. And who knows, maybe, you know, his work must have been finished for God to have taken him more back. Because he was, he's the one who opened my eyes to what this music was. Because I used to just sing and love it and have fun and enjoy it. And so what? You know, I love to sing and that's it. It was not until I started working with Bob and I saw how serious this man took his music. I've never seen anything like that. His music was his life. Nothing came before his music. That was it. No food, nothing, no money. Just his music. And then I started looking into this thing much deeper and said, but this is a serious business and this is much deeper than entertainment. This is like a responsibility you have on your shoulder to mankind. And that's when I started realizing what the whole thing is about and figure it out for myself and know that to be in this business of music, you are blessed because you are given the opportunity to communicate to the world through the medium of this music. You can send messages to the four corners of the earth through music. And once you can communicate to the world musically, because we cannot live without music and food, then we are powerhouse. We are blessed because we have it in our hands to decide where this world can go. We can unite. We can bring together. We can break barriers. The music is one of the most powerful weapons that we have today on this earth. Music released Nelson Mandela from prison when everyone started singing and the word, the sound, and the power that went towards the release of Nelson. There was no choice. So the music is powerful. That's why I usually pray and I ask God to open the eyes of all our singers and DJs because the Bible calls upon, God calls upon the singers and players of instrument. I would like them to be aware of their position, to know that they are powerful and they can make positive contribution to mankind and to the world, especially this generation who needs a lot of guidance. The music is all we have in our hands. We see where the, from the baby is born and you play any music and the hearing is good, the baby start to move to the beat. And from the child get to the age of two and start speaking or three, they can sing a song from the beginning to the end. So why not? Make, send a good message to teach, to educate, to uplift, to everything that's positive we can do through the music. We have the power in our hands to do that. And I think that is what Bob Marley, one of the persons I know, and up, there are many other artists, you know, Dennis Brown, these are artists that send good positive message. Freddie McGregor. Barry Salmon, Barrington Levy, you know, all of these singers, Jimmy Cliff, we said they send positive message to the world to unite the world. So that's what I am beseeching to everyone to do. Let's come together and realize who we are and how blessed we are to be in the position that we can communicate through the medium of music, that people can hear us in Jericho, no matter what part of the earth. We should just continue to feed souls with positiveness and teach and educate. Hope you liked our video. If so, subscribe.
Don't forget the bell for notifications and give us a thumbs up. Let us know what you're thinking by writing a comment or visit ifetop10.com for more entertainment news. Thanks for watching.